Hey everyone! In this video, you're gonna learn how to add Phantom to MetaMask, swap assets from Ethereum to Phantom, and connect to DApps on Phantom using MetaMask. I'm gonna use SushiSwap as an example, but all DApps will work the same way. Before starting, make sure to have the MetaMask extension installed in your browser, have a basic understanding of how MetaMask works, there are plenty of tutorials online, and have some ETH to pay for the transaction fees when doing the cross-chain swap from Ethereum to Phantom. Let's start by setting up Phantom as a custom chain on MetaMask. Andre built a great tool for this, so there's no manual input. Go to chainlist.org, this website here, Connect your wallet using MetaMask. So click on connect here. Select the account that you want to connect, even if it doesn't really matter which one you choose. Click connect. And then now search for Phantom or FTM. And then click on the add to MetaMask button. Approve. And switch network. Now, if you go to MetaMask, you will see that up here it says Phantom Opera. And if you click on that, the network list will now show Phantom Opera with all the other um, Ethereum mainnet and Ethereum testnets. Now, let's also make a quick fix and add the Explorer. This has to be done manually for now. So click on the colored icon on the top right, this one here. Click on Settings, then scroll down to Networks, scroll down to Phantom Opera, and then here where it says Block Explorer URL, instead of the Foundation website, just input HTTP FTMScan.com and click Save. Done, you can close this. Now let's switch back to Ethereum for now. And it's as simple as that. Now you will see that I have some ETH and also some FTM. And what I want to do now is to transfer cross-chain this 300 FTM from Ethereum to Phantom. Let's see how to do that. Now let's go to the bridge at multichain.xyz. I already have it open on a different tab. Here it is. With multi-chain, you can swap assets cross-chain, so from Ethereum to Phantom and back, and also to and from other chains. As usual, connect your wallet. I'll make sure that I'm going to connect the correct one, which is this, account 15 in my case. There we go. Now, click on the From logo, and there we go. It's already showing the tokens that you can transfer because with this little icon here, which is the wallet icon, it shows the balance of the tokens that are in your wallet that you can transfer cross-chain. If you click that, it will show all the assets, a list of all the assets that are possible to transfer across different chains. So anyway, let's go back to our wallet and click on FTM. There we go. And by default, it will also show FTM as the destination network in the to field. Here you can either input any amount that you want, or you can just click on the balance here so that you can transfer the whole thing. Now, please note that there's an 80 FTM fee to cover for the transaction fees. That's on Ethereum, so there's not much that we can do about it. Well, now just click on Transfer and approve all the transactions that will show on MetaMask. So confirm. It will ask for a couple of confirmation. I will also pause the video right now because Ethereum might take a few minutes and it's not necessary for you to waste your time. I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. And done. You will see the confirmation down at the bottom. They successfully transferred FTM from Ethereum mainnet to Phantom mainnet. Let's also verify it on MetaMask. So click on MetaMask 
and you will see that your Ethereum mainnet balance of FTM is zero. But let's switch from Ethereum mainnet to Phantom Opera, and you will see the 220 FTM that you transfer cross-chain from Ethereum to Phantom. Now, the cool thing about Phantom is that your Ethereum and Phantom addresses are exactly the same. You just need to change network in MetaMask, just like I did, to go from one chain to the other. How cool is that? Now, let's see how to use SushiSwap on Phantom. Once again, I'm using SushiSwap as an example to show you how to connect MetaMask and interact with the DApp, but you can also do the same on Cream, Curve, and any other protocol or DApp the diesel will be on Phantom. Let's go to exchange.sushi.com. There we go. And click on connect to a wallet. MetaMask. Select the account. Next, connect. Done. Beautiful. Now you'll see your balance of 220 FTM. We're connected again to Phantom Opera. And, uh, well, let's try some simple swaps on Sushi. On Phantom, since the transaction fees are so low, you can do swaps that wouldn't make sense on Ethereum. For example, you can just swap one FTM. On Ethereum, that would cost so much just in fees alone. But on Phantom, you can do it. Okay, let's go ahead and let's swap one FTM to USDC. Let's select USDC here. There we go. And let's do one. There we go. And click on swap. Confirm. Now, the transaction is confirmed already in the background, but it takes a little bit of time for the UI of the website and MetaMask to catch up with what happened on the blockchain. Yeah, Phantom is that fast. There we go. Now it's already been confirmed, also in the, on the front end, but let's go on the Explorer and verify that timestamp was 18 seconds ago and it already has a few confirmations. And, well, let's go back to the Explorer. There's one thing that is very, very important. It's this, one tenth of a cent for transaction fee. That, you know, in comparison to do something like this on Ethereum would cost maybe 30, 40, 50 dollars. So it wouldn't really make sense as I was saying earlier. And, uh, well, now let's swap a little bit more. Maybe let's do 30 FTM to USDC. Confirm. As I said, transaction is already confirmed in the background. Just needs a little bit of time on the UI for uh, showing the confirmation. MetaMask already showed me the pop-up. It's out of the recording screen, so you guys can't see it. But Actually, we can go here. There we go. Be on the Explorer. Yeah, 23 seconds ago and already 11 block confirmations. So that's pretty amazing. So I swapped $13 worth of Phantom. And once again, the transaction fee is $0.001. So a fraction of a cent. It's very incredible. Well, I'm going to do some more swaps from say USDC to, well, let's swap back to FTM. So let's do approve USDC. Again, it's approved already in the background. Just needs a, some time for the UI to catch up. Confirmed on MetaMask, let's wait, there we go. Approval already happened, so Timestamp is 25 seconds ago and already 16 block confirmations. So yeah, blocks are around one to two seconds. And once again, this is even less expensive than, than a transaction fee since it was uh, just an approval. And now we can swap our USDC back to Phantom. Confirm. And done again. It's already confirmed, so 16 seconds ago for block confirmations. And once again, 
transaction fees 0.002 FTM, which is 0.0001 uh, dollars. So it's pretty incredible. If we go back to my wallet, let's see that we did quite a few um, transactions on uh, on Sushi Swap, but uh, as I was pointing out earlier, the incredible thing is this. Besides, of course, the you know the, the, the speed we already seen you know, three minutes ago and already 118 block confirmations. This would, this would, this would take many minutes on Ethereum, uh, if not hours, and you know these fees, a fraction of a cent. That is it for today, and uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. And make sure to share it with your friends so that they can learn how amazing and fast and cheap Phantom is.